I'm Kathy Gans and I'm a fiber artist. I'm a fiber artist and I think I've always been a fiber artist. I made my first quilt when I was 16 and I'm sure it's fallen apart by now, but uh, that was my beginning. And then I didn't uh, do that for another 20 years and I decided to start working with fiber. Uh, it's tactile, it's beautiful, uh, the color draws me in. Uh, the pieces I make, I started out with traditional quilts and like a lot of people who've done that for 20 years, I evolved and I started doing fiber art. I started with landscape quilts. I used to teach landscape quilts for one of the local quilt shops. And from there, I started doing more and more of that. Uh, landscapes are kind of in my DNA. I did that with photography and I've now taken on doing it with fiber and expanded into paints and uh, paper and other media that I add to my fiber. But fiber and stitch will always be a part of what I do. It's the natural world that really inspires me. Uh, the window in my studio faces the mountains and it's constantly changing. The light is incredible and it's amazing. I started with photography, doing black and white and doing darkroom work uh, 30, 35 years ago. And that has fed into my fiber art as well. When I look out the window, I will see a gray day or I'll see brilliant blue skies or the way the light filters at sunset or sunrise. And everything is just amazing. And it prompts me to pull fabrics to try to recreate that, to create that feeling of what's going on in the natural world around me. Uh, I've set this up, it's not a large space, it's about 11 by 12, but I've set it up so that I see what I'm working with. I like to have the visual prompts to help me um, make my pieces. I don't start with a plan, I'll start with an idea. And I go from there, I start pulling the fabric. I have over 3,000 fabrics. And I pull from those fabrics and create my pieces as I go. I love fabric. Uh, I used to be a clothes maker uh, before I started quilting. And once I started quilting, clothes making just went out the window. No more of that. Uh, it's too constrained. I like the freedom of working with fabric. As I mentioned, fabric is very tactile. Uh, the texture of it, the look of it, you take several different uh, pieces, different shades, different textures, and put them together and you create something new. It's the surprises that I enjoy. Working with fabric is a surprise. Uh, you never know exactly how things are going to turn out. I am compelled to create art. I've always been creative. I've never felt that I could draw, but fabric is my medium. And working with fabric is soothing. I always worked in left brain uh, business roles and it can be very stressful. And coming home and seeing a room full of color and ideas that I've put up on the wall, things I put next to each other, it takes me away from that stressful work world and it gives me a place to rest. Uh, it gives me a way to feed my soul. It gives me a way to leave something, a legacy, uh, that says, Kathy has been here. Uh, and you never know what's going to happen with those pieces after you're gone, but uh, hopefully there'll be some pieces that I make that speak to people that were in my life. So when I'm gone, my pieces are left behind uh, to speak for me.